Hey what's up guys, in today's video I am going to show how to downgrade or resize your digital ocean droplets. So let's start. So in the dashboard of the projects you can see all the droplets and also you can see your domain here and to select any droplet you have to click on the droplet there and then we are now on the single droplet as you can see there and then you have to go to resize and before downgrade or resize the droplet you can create your snapshots from there so what are digital ocean snapshots snapshots are on demand digital images of digital ocean droplets and volumes saved to your account use them to create a new droplets and volumes with the same content and now i am not going to create snapshots i am just going to resize my droplet so click on resize on the left menu so as you can see uh, from there you can resize your droplet and it also tells us our currently specification of the droplet so 8 gb ram and 4 cpu are installed and currently i have this package so there are two sections cpu and ram only and the second one is disk cpu and ram so first one will only resize cpu and ram only and the second one will resize disk cpu and ram so if i select the second one then I will be able to resize my disk, CPU and RAM also. But I am going to select first one. So if I scroll down then you can see basic general purpose CPU optimized, memory optimized. These are the packages. If I have to resize my basic package then I am going to select this one. And this is general package. And in the CPU optimized package we will see the optimized packages of the CPU. And as like memory optimized. So I am going to select all types and then scroll down. So as you can see my currently package is this one and I am going to install this one. So to install this one you have to deactivate your droplet first. So on the right top corner you can turn off your droplet first. So it gives us alert message. So it tells us when a droplet is off. Its data and IP addresses are retained and its disk, CPU and RAM are reserved. And also you continue to accurate its data transfer allowance. And it also gives us the warning. You will still be billed for the turn of droplet. To end billing destroy the droplet instead. So I am going to click on this button. So as you can see it is loading there. And it may take times. So as you can see our droplet is off now. And now I am going to resize my droplet. I am going to select this package. And it also tell us the price of the droplet there on the right corner. So I am going to click on resize there. And it also tell us resizing can take up to 1 minute per GB. For example if my data is 1 GB then it will take 1 minute. And in the top of the page you can see the resizing of the droplet is in progress. It may take time, so we have to wait there. So as you can see our droplet is now resized and if you scroll down then you can see the basic is select now. And now we have to turn it on. Just click on it. So as you can see our droplet is now on and now you have to make sure your domains. So by this way you can downgrade or you can resize your droplet easily. So if you find our video useful don't forget to like, subscribe and share and finally thanks for watching.